This is a LiPo battery that I've been absolutely terrible to. See, I've discharged it too low and now I'm getting a low voltage error from my charger and it won't charge it. Now, you may have heard somebody on the internet tell you to just charge that thing as a NICAD battery. But no, your charger has almost no safety checks under the nickel chemistry. So that's a terrible idea. Because it's 2021, we all have smart chargers in this hobby now, and you are a smart boy. So let's do some smart things. We're gonna start by going up to our battery type, or it could be called battery chemistry in some chargers, and choose LIFE, or lithium iron phosphate, which has a lower voltage range than LiPo's, but it still balances. And it'll stop charging the battery before it gets too high, possibly saving your house from a fire. Then just make sure to charge the battery really slowly. I'm gonna use a 0.7 amp charge rate, but you could go even slower if you had a smaller battery. You can see here that my charger is nearly finished charging. It's a really low amp rate and I've only put in 116 milliamp hours. Now the battery's done and I can go ahead and switch over to the LiPo mode and then put this battery into storage since I'm not gonna use it right now. Now, at this point, you might be asking, well, what if my battery is too low to charge even for the lithium iron phosphate chemistry? And to clear that up, your battery's done. If a LiPo battery is too low for the lithium iron phosphate chemistry, don't attempt to recharge it. You destroyed the battery. You gotta just chalk that up as an L and move on with your life. Don't burn your house down. Don't charge your battery at all if it looks like this. Be safe, subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. Also, please like and send this video to a friend if you think they could really use it. I really feel like that whole charge your LiPo battery on NICAD mode has gone on for too long. But right on guys, catch you next time.